What up guys, it's your girl Manny Beeks and I am back with more Peaky Blinders and if you're enjoying this reaction series or anything else I got on my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm here, you're here, let's be here together. And side note, my fro is looking very like voluminous in the in the frontal section today, which I like to see in the back is shrinkage. Shrinkage is real, y'all don't worry about that. But um, last time on Peaky Blinders, what do we have? We had um, Tommy running, continuously running the long con still. So trying to remember what all happened. Um, I feel like I need to start with Grace because child, like the way she inserts herself into things that, especially in that past episode that she didn't need to. Like, I don't, I understand that the IRA killed her father and such and such and blah, blah, blah. But what makes you think you should go and attempt to what interrogate i don't know what she attempted to do like i don't understand what her plan was when she ran up on the guy who was drinking who was asking um tommy to asking to buy the guns from tommy like i don't i don't understand what her purpose was encountering him but she did end up encountering him in an alley and shot him because he was like you know what you following me i'm gonna take you down to get interrogated by the ira ha but you know she killed him and left the body in the street of course someone saw it uh, someone reported it and it got back to the, um, I can't remember his name. What do they call them? Detective? I feel like detective is the wrong word. There's another word for it, but I can't remember it right now. And um, it's just putting a, a, a spot, like it's just making her stand out more than she wants to if her whole entire plan is to befriend Tommy and, you know, get insinuate herself or, you know, Get her way up in there. I can't think of the right words right now. Everything's gone. Um, with their business and what's going on. Um, let's see. Tommy's whole plan was to go to the races and to get the security side of the races under his control. So he wants to continue to push out the Lees. And the Lees were skimming off the top. They were um, allowing the bookies to be not well, assaulted and robbed so they were like going to them like oh i'm selling cigarettes for uh four dollars or some shit and it'll take a handful of money out and be like thanks for the cigarette you know thanks for the money here's your cigarettes even though he, they were overpaying clearly paying for it um so to make himself look better he wanted grace to dress up real nice and pretty in her burlap red sack and go get Kimber's attention, which I mean, she did. She did. She got his attention. Um, and while they were talking, while him and Tommy and the accountant were talking business, you know, he was like, "Ooh, I kind of want to take her home and see if she'll let me." Didn't work out so well. Didn't work out so well. I didn't think that he would do it, but he went far with it before he actually stopped it on a, a BS reason but i mean he stopped it so i can't i be mad can i can i can i not be mad i mean she can be mad but not too mad because you put yourself in the position not the position to be assaulted but you put yourself you're trying to put yourself into his world for your mission so like girl protect your neck and she was getting ready to shoot him until he came in there but i think this just made their relationship because it's going to be a relationship um a little more concrete because he didn't give a reason as to why he stopped it because he didn't have to stop it he could have just let it happen and let her fend for herself um but yeah so he's got the uh, security contract so to speak for the races now um what's going on everybody knows his sister is pregnant his sister married freddie um and freddie is not taking the hint or leaving town or understanding that part of the deal that he that tommy have uh that tommy has with the uh the detective is that he leaves town and doesn't come back so i'm not i don't understand <sighs> there's only one way to fix this and that's either actually two ways to tell him what the hell is going on and be like you got to go or to kill his ass and i don't think he's going to do that because of his sister so on that note we're going to go ahead and jump into season one episode four of peaky blinders what is the time jump <laughs> Where are they going? Because it looks like they're packed. 
Did our friends give us what we asked for? So was it a honeymoon? How much? 200 pounds. I just wish that he would leave for her safety. Like, come on. He's like a fish. Right. We'll keep fishing. Mm. Love it. The suits, though. Look how nice he looks. What is that? What the fuck is that? Are those the Lees? Oh, fine. Bruh. 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 Now get out. All right. All right. Don't do that. That's the wrong spot to do that in. What is going on? Who's this little kid? Is he a Lee? She looks nice. I love that shirt. Do they know? And they mm. Okay, I knew he was part of the Lees. Those suits are nice, but... Bruh, that's not what you want. There's nobody in there. I'm confused. Paul, give him 10 bobs some new shoes. Is that it, John? Tommy, it would be better to do this without you. <laughs> now, what's your point? What the kids need is a mother. Did you pick someone? So that's why I'm getting married. Bitch, what? Oh, you. Does this poor girl know you're going to marry her or are you just going to spring it on her all of a sudden? I've already oh. proposed and she, oh, she said, bitch. Yes. I think there's a shell about to land and go bang. <laughs> He's, um, he's, uh, Lizzie Stock. Yeah. Who's that? Why are they laughing? Sure. Why are they laughing? Lizzie Stark's a strong woman, and I'm Why? sure she provides a fine service for her customers. I won't hear the word. Oh, oh, is Understand she a prostitute? Is she a prostitute? Word. What happened? What word is that, John? You know what word that is. Everybody bloody knows. Everybody can go Does he love her? Oh, that word, or... Prostitute, how about that one? Tommy, I love you pieces, but can you not? Can you can you not antagonize your brother? All right, people, change. Like, 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 we, we, he we, is we, so we, enraptured. Like, what change, happened? Right? Was the vagina that great? Does what happened? Oh, she does? What did the Can I see her? I won't do it with that. Uh person. Tommy's like, listen, don't put me in a position to hurt your feelings because I will hurt your feelings, sir. I, I want you to see it. Brave is going where no man's gone before. And with Lizzie Stark, John, that is really not what you'll be doing. <laughs> Welcome to the family. Look at Tommy's face. Life. Look at his face. Oh, because I need someone. Look at his face. I love face. Why cutters? I mean, why would they leave wire cutters? Nobody move. I think our friends are playing the game. Somewhere in here, there's a home grenade. Holy mm. Jesus. Boys, no. It's not in here. Where is it at? If it was in here, it would have blown by now. It was my name on that bullet. That is it in said. the bar? He set up a trap, all right. He set it up Where is it at, me. though, dog? Finn? Finn, stay exactly where you are. Bruh. <laughs> I'll pretend it was you. I want you to climb out exactly the same way you climbed in, okay? <laughs> no, no, Finn! <laughs> breaks off you boy dog when people are trying to tell you this is not the time that you want to play fun and games dog we're trying to save you bitch fucking kids oh i love children i do but when i'm talking to you in the serious tone you have to recognize the serious voice like boy did you pee your pants because you should have jesus bruh Oh, he pissed now. Oh, you have fucked up. You fucked up. Oh, no. There's like, oh, shit. Wasn't he supposed to be in his car? Yeah, you almost killed a kid, dog. Let me say something. Fuck out of here, sir. Is this where Lizzie is? Is that her name? Is that her name? 
Now, who's this? I'm confused. You come in here, boast, and you're gonna do someone down, and in the same breath, ask me to trust mm -hmm. you. Technically. You're a dreamer, Freddy. You give money away while we rot in here. You talk about revolution. I need to know. Who are you loyal to? Is baby? she stroking ball sacks in the water? Oh, she is. Look at that. I said, who are you loyal uh, right to? Right now, he's loyal to the hot water and, and the hands on the balls. Uh, afterwards, I didn't even think about it. I'm gonna think about it. I'm think about it a little bit. But then, if he does that in the water, then would the water be clean? Can he wash in the water? Our outfits are always on point. I love it. Talk to Polly. Did you have something to do with this? Whose address is it? Tell me, I'd like to suggest a strategy. What is his name? Please tell me his name again. This time I promise I'll remember it. I promise. Stanley Chapman is a bigger fish than mm -hmm. Freddie Thorne. Okay. He's currently holding 200 pounds in cash given to the Communist Party by the Russian government. He's like, bitch, what? You might even get that mm. medal. They are riding him for not no. uh, going to... Before or... I give you the address, I want your word that you'll let Freddie Thorne and my sister leave the city. The thing is, they won't leave the city. I don't trust that. They won't leave the city because Freddie is stubborn. Freddie thinks he, he knows it all. You hold all the cards. But I hope to God that... My dismissal doesn't come before your decision to hand back those. Because whoever's cards. coming next is not. And I say this for not your better. Sake because if I were to be fired, and it were your. Are you going to try to kill him? I would do things that would shame oh. the devil. My baby insider would be of no consequence to me. Is that what you really want to lead with? Would be your little brother, Finn. Is that what you. He would, however, be lifted as a juvenile and dumped in that part of the adult prison where men have the most appetite for boys like him. Oh, that would be a dark day. Is that what you really want to do? Shelby. Is that the move you really want to make? If my dismissal comes okay. before your decision. I mean, you understand? It's a good threat. Don't get me wrong. However, I know this. The clock is ticking. Um, that that bear has claws. You were so mad you pointed a gun at him. That's how mad you were. He's gonna remember that shit. He's gonna hold on to those words. Look what we found. Look what I found. I did it. See, Stanley Chapman really does have snow in his boots. <laughs> that is lightweight petty. Well, I thought you'd done a deal. What was that what you <coughs> thought? Well, you gave your word. My word. Bruh, you're setting yourself up for some serious situationals. You think my campaign against Shelby has become personal? Yes. Correct. <laughs> Spot on, as they say in London society. Absolutely. That's such a bad idea. Bruh. Tommy did a deal. Return for safe passage for you and Ada. He's given them Stanley and the money. Hmm. Money? What money? Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. You're not Who that told smart. told you about the money? Who do you think? You did a deal for me. You did flatter yourself. For Ada. And you think this copper will keep his word? No. If he does, you're safe. If he doesn't, Chapman will give you up. You'll still have to leave town. Same result. Exactly. So neat. So leave. Except there's one thing that you got wrong. I'm not leaving. Stanley won't be able to give up my address because he doesn't know it. So you won't leave? No, I won't fucking leave. 
And if you want me out of Birmingham, it'd have to be in a wooden box. It's going to be. You realize that, right? So fucking stupid. You lay a hand on our aid and I'll put you in a wooden box myself. Yeah. Don't play games. Bruh. I don't understand why he just doesn't leave. He's so fucking stubborn. You're so stubborn. Jesus. Like, for what? You want to stick around for what? They've given you three chances. Three. To get the hell out of Dodge. And you're still sitting there. Damn. So frustrating. So frustrating. I feel it frustrated. <sighs> so find some stairs, throw him down, and call the coroner. You should be thinking if you're if you're gonna He's use bracing. if you're gonna use you the stairs bit. Ask about the welfare of his mistress. Don't. Saltley. Don't do that. Like what? If you're gonna do the don't do that. Like I don't understand the question. I can't. My face hurts. Kimber, Mr. Roberts, come on, have a look around. He's like, do I have to? My shoes are clean. You guys are dirty. Mm. The Shelby family has its first legal racetrack pitch. They're so excited. I just hope it works out for them. Brother doesn't obey the law, but he has rules. Precise man, your brother. Is my head in approach? It is now. <laughs> One, two, three. Campbell's his name. I will search someone by one. 